Hi, this is Mr. Martinson. I'm today going to tell you a little bit about how to use the mixing console to um, get the audio output to match properly for uh, the video broadcast for the ROS report. Um, it's, it's a fairly easy job, but uh, there are some elements that you really need to pay close attention to in order to do a good job of mixing the audio so that it, it's, in, it, it's in good shape for uh, the broadcast. Really not terribly complicated, but let me step you through the process. So this is the mixing board for the ROS report. It, uh, it has three different buttons here on the, on the button bar, and I, I'll try to point here. So three different buttons that you can work with. These buttons for, are for muting the audio. It, as you press the buttons, you'll note that the audio for that particular channel goes away. Um, what you're going to need to do is make sure that you mute all three of them. Make sure that you mute all three of them, and notice the the red line on this box. That tells us that the audio for the uh, broadcast is muted. So one of the important parts of what you're doing is mixing the audio so that you can mute it um, while we are running a video broadcast. So that's what that's for, uh, the, the three buttons here. These, are, these correspond to the three different microphones, mic one, mic two, and mic three. Um, an important element in here is setting the volume levels for each of your um, speakers. There's a rocker here that controls the gain output. Can you see those? Those gain output controls set the volume level for each item. So as I'm talking now, you can see that I'm clipping, I'm peaking. The volume is as high as it can possibly be. And as I back that down, it's a little bit more understandable and the reading levels are, are good. You'll want to start in the middle and have each person, before the broadcast, count to five so that the sound levels are the same between mic one and mic two. Um, ideally, you want to try to make them match as closely as possible. Um, and then the master uh, volume level is here. You'll want to just m basically work with those three volume levels and the mute controls. So when a, a, a video is running, you're going to mute the audio by finding each, three of the, each of those three mute buttons and pressing them at the same time. Watch. And that's how you can tell that the uh, video has been muted or the audio is muted while a video is running. It's important because people tend to talk during um, videos and we don't want that to be broadcast. Um, and then make sure that you're just mixing the audio levels so that um, you get a, a good quality uh, audio broadcast. So that's the, a little bit about how to mix audio for uh, the ROS report. It's really not a complicated process, but the more that you can be paying attention to the finer points so that those audio levels are mixing right, so that they're matching each other, the better the quality of the overall show. Um, teachers' biggest complaints to us in the ROS report have been that uh, the ROS reports videos are softer than the actual broadcast. So if we can match those two up, we'll be doing a better job.